Geelong, we're going to be on the valley. And it is, what's the time? 8 a.m. I haven't packed. I'm gonna leave the house at 11. Really leaving it to the last minute. <laughs> So I'm actually not on Beyond the Valley until tomorrow, but we made the executive decision by we, I mean M, myself and Suzanne, who are all going today, to drive up to Geelong, stay there tonight, stay there tomorrow night so that I'm not doing like up and back to Beyond the Valley in one day because it's like a two and a half hour drive. So I'm excited, but nerves are definitely starting to kick in. I have so much anxiety in my stomach. <laughs> Now, I know it's excessive because I'm only going for two days, but it's just easier if I have this because I can put everything I need in there and I feel like throwing up. <laughs> I'm going to be driving for the majority of the day. I've got to go pick up Em from the airport, Sue's from her house, and then we're all going in my car. So I'm just wearing something comfy, my EE onesie, onesie, bodysuit, and... The weather is so humid, so my hair is fucking frizzy. So I'm just going to straighten it. Truthfully, I'll probably end up washing it tonight anyway, so I can curl it tomorrow. And I'm just thinking, how the hell am I actually going to get all of our stuff in the car? Because Em has a suitcase. <laughs> I have a suitcase. And Molly's not a big car. She's a little car. I have to play Tetris. Mummy's only going for two days. I'll be back on Saturday, okay? I love you. Can I have a kiss? No kiss? <laughs> I love you so much. I won't be long, I promise. I feel like I'm not packing enough, but it's only two days. Surely. bad but I had to change the suitcase just to take a smaller one because I was just worried about the space in the car I feel like I'm cheating on July but I am taking their carry-on and yes I'm taking my air wrap both Em and I are going to use it I told her don't bring yours I'll bring mine because she's obviously flying in and I wanted her to not have like a heavy suitcase to travel with I've got my toiletries in here as well I feel like I can put this in the car <sighs> I'm so nervous I'm so nervous I have been doing a little bit of work just before I head off. I'm going to take my laptop just in case I need it while I'm there. Oh, I need a new USB. Bye, darling. I love you. Mummy's going to go. She'll see you soon. You're the cutest. I'll be back soon. Mum's just scrubbing away. <laughs> yeah. All right. Bye, guys. See ya. See you on Saturday. Look who's in Melbourne. Oh, my God. Hi. <laughs> guys, look at the back seat. I brought way too big of a suitcase. It's okay, I can still see out in the rear view. We're good. We're gonna go get Sue's now. Yay! Let's go! This is what three girls have packed for 48 hours. <laughs> We're in Geelong, we just got here. We're gonna go get some food and we need to eat before we do anything else because I can't concentrate. And then we're going to office works and then we're going to check in. It's actually quite cute here. That's the Westfield. We are hungry. What is everyone thinking? <laughs> Do I want lunch or breakfast? I'm very all day breakfast kind of gal. Where is the place, Suze? It's called. <laughs> I fell down the stairs. Satellite Hearts. That's a crystal shop. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah, when you were asking, I was like, how many times do you need us to say it? And then no. I was like, oh, she's got the camera. I've got the camera, I'm filming. <laughs> this is where we're going. Oh my God, <laughs> she's found this. <laughs> Thank you. 
What are you getting? I'm gonna buy some rosemary essential oil. Cute. Apparently, it helps your hair to grow. It does, yeah. Yeah, so we have to dilute it. So I'm gonna get this, because I actually want this. So many incense. I love incense. We're in office works because we're printing the run sheet for tomorrow and I need to buy a USB because we need a copy of the slideshow and the music on here just in case it doesn't work on their computer so we're trying to minimize the run sheet because it's 17 pages long <laughs> Mummager M in the house we have checked in we're staying at Ridges here in Geelong the accommodation looked good online it kind of looks all right in here looks all right I'm uh, <laughs> me just giving a review. Well, how's our view, Sus? Um, I can see like the clock tower, whatever that is. And Fantastic. I can also see the um the water. Look at yeah, this. As you can see, we've got Myers Street <laughs> over here, and the post office to the left. Fantastic. <laughs> Fantastic girls. I mean, what more could you ask for? I know <laughs> this beautiful roof as well. Well, got some natural lighting. We finally can rest. It's been a long day. <laughs> Please show us the cookies. Look what she it's bought like for us. It's like fully crumbs at this point. It's, you know what? Crumbs is good. I'm not, I'm not like complaining. It's like kind of raw and soft. Like I kind of want some. Perfect. Yeah, eat some. Thank you. <laughs> I've just driven back to Office Works because I need a cord that allows the USB to transfer from my computer because my computer's like USB-C. And I have this cord at home, but I don't know what I was doing this morning. I didn't pack it. Anyway. Round two. A smarter doll would have actually taken her laptop and the USB and seen if it fits, but let's go back to the hotel and see if it works. So we had a nap for like an hour and now we're going to dinner. He's trying to run through the beds. He's trying not to run the birds over. We're parked on the pier. How cute. Our dinner is done and we've come to get some snacks. Good old Woolies. I really want tiny teddies. <laughs> okay, we are back. We've had our snacks. We did a two, well, we did one rehearsal. Sue's helped us. And now we're going to bed. I wash my hair so it's clean for tomorrow. Good night, Sue's. Good night. <laughs> Em's in the bathroom. Good night, Em. Huh? Good night. Good night. <laughs> we'll see you in the morning. The nerves are so real. I feel so sick. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna wear this later. I want to get off the stage. My stage outfit is different, but I don't own festival shit because I'm an old bitch, you guys. <laughs> and I'm curling my hair with a straightener just because I don't have time to fuck around with the air wrap today. Oh, I'm looking terrible. Okay, I'm ready. This is not my outfit for the stage. This is like what I'll wear afterwards. This green skirt, this white top and these boots. And we're just ignoring the nerves right now. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, so we are 45 minutes away from Baruna Plains, which is where Beyond the Valley is. We're driving to like the artist entry. Um, I have no idea what to expect. <laughs> we're waiting for Em. Um, we're Em and I are gonna get changed. <laughs> and yeah, I feel sick. <laughs> we're literally in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> but we're 20 minutes away. And we just drove past a um, police setup. And we were all very scared, even though we are all very sober. <laughs> More importantly, look how good I look. Your makeup is a gimme. It's actually not, it feels so powdery. It does look powdery. It does not look powdery. It's like powder actually glowing. Like, I think it's because I, I usually have so much. Like, I usually don't use any powder that I look like greasy as fuck. I think we needed the powder <laughs> because we're going to be on the stage. Yeah. One day after the artist entry, we bougie. No, no, no. <laughs> How funny. Do we? Hi. Hi. How are you? Good, thank you. We got our passes <laughs> at the accreditation. That's so and my car got a sticker saying that I'm an artist. What the hell? <laughs> what? Who, who let me be an artist? I'm excited now. <laughs> okay, so that's the main stage. 
And then I'm pretty sure that was that could possibly be the podcast stage. No, it's right next to the valley thing. That's fucking huge. Yeah, it, well, it doesn't look small. <laughs> Hang on, maybe. <laughs> no, the podcast stage will not be that big. No, no okay, maybe away. that's the main stage there. Yeah, I think that's the main stage. Or maybe that's the podcast stage there. Guys, we're literally behind, like in the like <laughs> zoned off area. Yeah, this is this is the VIP back. Backs. We can see the scaffolding of where they're fucking building the stages. I think that's the podcast, maybe. Honestly, Adele, twenty-year-old Adele, is squealing right now because she can't believe that she's doing this. I really wish we looked up the DJs and what they look like, so we knew who was who. Who's who? Because we're not gonna know who anyone is. I feel like I'm gonna like. I'm gonna be, I could be sitting next to fuckhead, and I don't know. Who. <laughs> Like, so, I don't the festival unless I've got an artist pass. This is the compound where we will be relaxing today and our call time's not one till 1 30 and what's the time right now somebody 10 15 yeah <laughs> so we're a little bit early we're also going to get changed and get ready when it's a bit closer so i think that's the podcast stage the yellow one there that's a main stage that's a main stage that's something i don't know <laughs> it is a beautiful intimate vibe in that yeah. tent yes Suze so is going to be our assistant on the laptop <laughs> Em and I will be on the couches, but it's very cozy. Like, yeah, it's nice. I feel like and even dark. if that was full, it's okay. We're gonna be fine. That is less people than basically besties. Yes, I can do this. We can do this. We can do this. We, we have each other. That. There's a Ferris wheel over there, which we're gonna go on later. All of this is actually food and water. I have to say, it's it's very well organized for, for a girl that's 30 and doesn't go to festivals anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I sure. I got a burger. I also got M's sides in mine. Em's got my side. She got a wrap. She's got a whole ass steak. <laughs> Love that. Good luck like cutting that with a um, cardboard knife. <laughs> this is the fit. Let me show you. Full length. And then I'm going to get changed back into the other outfit when I'm done. I'm starting to get a little nervous again, but I'm feeling better once we ate. What type of uh, talent do you manage? Influencers and like podcast hosts. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So current company. Current company. <laughs> yes. yes. Me. Emily has come on to the podcast. She's come from behind the scenes and come on to the podcast. So she's going to help me today. Oh, breaching the yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of pressure, but All that's right. okay. Assistant. Correct. Hey. So I'm just an assistant. Jeez. Not just an assistant. I'm also emotional support. Correct. Support, so. <laughs> well, I'd like to congratulate you for accumulating on. This is my tent. MTV, welcome to my crib. This is me. That's Mason. He just did his show, and we are going backstage. I'm just so sad to catch what. I know. <laughs> Wait. This is our green room, guys. It's very cool. Oh my god, I'm getting nervous now. Cute feet though. <laughs> Ready for my job. How are you feeling? I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm excited. Yes. There's people waiting and yeah, I'm just there's people waiting for you. <laughs> I can't believe this is actually happening. <laughs> we are just decompressing. How is that everybody? It was so good. We are a little bit wrecked, but we're just chilling, charging up the phone. I got changed again. We're going to go and party now. Not really, because I'm driving and I'm not going to, you know, drink, but we are going to go dance and whatnot. Yeah. <laughs> 
We are home. It's 1.30. Not bad. I tell you what though, that drive, not a fun drive home. You know why? Not one street light. The girls are just putting on their pimple patches right now. <laughs> Ending the night with a pimple patch. I need to get in the shower. My feet are so sore. We Last time we checked, we did 25,000 steps today. Take as many as you want. 25,000. And I think I'm losing my voice. Oh my God. <gasps> Touching the ground with my feet. Have you not even taken your shoes off yet? No, I'm taking them off now. <laughs> <laughs> it feels so good. Oh my goodness gracious me. Why is this so hard? This is just delusion, honestly. Just tired, everybody. Good night. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning, everybody. We are alive. I just need to show you something. We did 30,000 steps yesterday. So we've all got sore feet. Mine are very sore. I don't know about everyone else. I just said that we all do, but my, I definitely do. How are you girls feeling? Yes, my yeah. back hurts. <laughs> Out of 10, what's your vibe? 10, like a <laughs> 10 too, but like three physically. <laughs> we're gonna drive home now. We're getting Macca's brekkie and we're just waiting for our hash browns. Yum. Napkin, M. Thank you. You're welcome. Also got a bacon egg with muffin. I actually wasn't too hungry, but I just got more hungry as I was driving. <laughs> Why does that look so good? Yum. Okay. The road trip shall continue. I'm home. Did you miss mommy? Were you a good boy? Oh, yeah? All right. No jumping. No jumping. Hi. Oh, my honey. I missed you so much. Hello. <laughs> okay. The plan is to clean this room, to put everything in the wash, to shower up. And then we can rest and say goodbye to this BTV video. I'm just going to chuck everything in because it was quite dusty and I blew my nose last night and all that came out was dust. And I just wore everything I wore yesterday, dust. Anyway, I had such a good time and I'm so glad that I got to share it with Suze and with Em. I didn't pack too many unnecessary things, so it's not that much washing. I don't want to throw this out, like, I just want to keep it for a while. <laughs> Chewy wrappers in my pockets. This is my second load, all the lights. I've also just booked in a pedicure, so after I have a shower next, I'm going to go do that. I still have to unpack all the toiletries and stuff, but at least I can get rid of this feeling. So usually when I curl my hair, it never really goes, like it's gone crunchy and hard. I think it's just full of dust, like everything else. Wait, let me show you my shoes. These are the shoes I had on. Hi Frank, can you see like the layers of dust? He's been sniffing them. It's okay, it's all right. Anyway, oh, hi, yes, I am back. <laughs> He's been sniffing them, but um, I'm gonna wipe these down and then put them away. Just, yeah, filth. And then I've hung out whatever I had in the load just then. Do you know how good that shower felt? I thought last night's shower felt good, but this one felt mm, so good. Oh my god. I'm not wearing makeup today, and I just did a Dennis Gross chemical peel as well. I'm gonna just stick to some moisturizer right now and just keep it very casual and very, you know, no effort today. <laughs> I'm just relaxing. I use conditioner, not K18 today, because my hair felt matted and very, very dry, and I just needed it to feel soft. <laughs> Even if maybe K18 probably would have technically been better, I just needed the soft hair feeling. Dried, ready for my pedicure. I'm gonna go get a pedicure, and I'm actually gonna wrap the video here. Thank you guys for coming to Beyond the Valley and thank you so much for your support this year. By the time you watch this, it will be January. I'm not exactly sure what day it will come out, but I want to wish you a happy new year. 
I want to wish you all the love, health and success in 2024 and I hope that this year can be amazing for you. If you had a hard 2023, just know that it will get better. The light is always there at the end of the tunnel, okay? Hang in there. Look after yourselves. I will be back to regular scheduling very soon on this channel. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I definitely enjoyed going. I know it's not my usual content, but deep down, old party girl Adele <laughs> was screaming and having the best time of her life at Beyond the Valley. And I think if I was going to go to a festival like that again, I would definitely go back to Beyond the Valley. But I am feeling a little bit old and a little bit like my age and a little bit like that chapter of my life is one that I'm happy to revisit for a very short time, but not one that I think I'll be revisiting the way that I used to. But I had a great time. I made core memories with Em and with Suzanne and it was just incredible and I'm so glad that I got to share it with you guys. Also, some of you watching probably listen to my podcast, so if that's you, you are the reason that I actually got that opportunity and I'm so, 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 so grateful. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. I love you and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.